If you're looking for a controller for your home or small business, Rainbird's TM2 is loaded with features. I'm Dwayne Smith, your Sprinkler Warehouse Product Specialist. Let's get started. If you need a controller that has 12 zones or less, Rainbird's TM2 has got you covered. It's an indoor-outdoor controller with all the features you'd expect. It comes in 4, 6, 8, and 12 station models. If I were you, I'd buy one with at least a couple of more zones than you think you need, in case you want to add a zone to your landscape later. You can have three programs, and each program can have up to four start times. That gives you plenty of flexibility for your watering schedule. So why would you want three separate programs? Maybe the plants in one section of your landscape will need watered every day or every other day, while other sections of your landscape you'll water once a week. Additionally, with four start times per program, you can set your controller to split up watering to allow the water to soak in. Or you can water both in the morning and the evening. You can attach a rain sensor or a rain and freeze sensor sold separately. This prevents unnecessary watering, so for example, if it's raining, your sprinkler system won't turn on. The TM2 does not have the ability to add a flow sensor. If you want a flow sensor, you'll need to check out the ESP ME3. The TM2 has non-volatile memory, so if you lose power, you won't have to reprogram the controller. My very favorite feature about this controller is the ability to upgrade it by adding Wi-Fi. With the Link Wi-Fi system, you're essentially turning this into a smart controller. The Link Wi-Fi system allows you to run the controller from the Rainbird app. From the app, you can program the controller, start and stop watering, and most importantly, set up automatic watering adjustments based on local weather reports. This can set you up for some serious savings on your water bill, and you can even operate your sprinkler system with Alexa or Google Home. We'll do an overview of this very powerful Rainbird app in another video. Let's do a brief overview of the interface. The offsetting. No watering occurs when the dial is set here. If the watering is currently happening, this will turn it off. Auto is the default position. Programming will occur as normal. All programs that have a start time specified will run at the appropriate time. Date and time. This is where you set the current date and time, of course. Start times. You set each start time for the program here. The first, second, third, and fourth here refers to start times for a program that's not the start times for each station. Stations will run sequentially. Each program can have up to four start times. For example, it says program A here. If I set first to 7 a.m., it's going to run all of program A once at 7 a.m. And then if I have a second start time here at 9 a.m., then it will run all of program A at 9 a.m. You change programs with this button over here. Run times. This is how long each station is set to water. You'll want to adjust that depending on the needs specific to your zone, whether it's your lawn or your flower beds, etc. Once again, this is program A, so maybe in program A I only want zone 1 to run, but in program B I want all the zones to run. And maybe program A is every day and program B is three times a week, however you want to do it. Watering days. By default, it's ready to program for days of the week. Use the plus and minus signs here to turn each day on or off. Or you can run your program by cycles. That means every so many days. Press the arrow key until you see this screen. You can set it to water every other day, every third day, all the way to every 31st day. And adjust how many days you want with the plus or minus sign. Days remaining is how many days before the controller will start the cycle. There's also a hidden function here. If you press and hold both arrow keys, you can choose odd or even days if that's your preference. And if you're running cycles function or the odd or even days function, you can permanently turn off certain days of the week. For example, maybe your lawn guys mow every Tuesday. So here's how you do that. With the dial set to water days, choose the correct program you want to prevent from watering. And hold the program select button until you see perm off. Use the minus key to turn off any day that you don't want this particular program to water. Once again, these settings are per program, so you could set program A on odd days and B on even days and C on Fridays. It's incredibly flexible. Sensor. If you have a sensor attached, 
Here is where you can choose to have the controller ignore the sensor if you want. By default it's set to active, which means it will stop watering when the sensor tells it to. Seasonal adjustment. This allows you to keep the same watering schedule, but reduces or increases how you water by percentage. You can water as little as 5% of the scheduled watering time all the way to 200%. And you can set this per program A, B, or C as well. Manual programming allows you to run one program or even just one station right now. And additionally, there's a delay watering function. If you want to delay watering for several days, turn the dial to auto, press and hold the plus key until you see the word delay. From there, you can decide how long to wait before the program resumes, up to 14 days. To add Link Wi-Fi, remove this cover and insert the module right here. You can download the free Rainbird app from Google Play or the App Store. So that's the Rainbird TM2. It will keep your lawn healthy and happy for years to come. Order yours today on sprinklerwarehouse.com. Remember, Sprinkler Warehouse has everything you need to make your trees, lawn, flower beds, and gardens lush and beautiful. Questions? Chat with one of our incredible customer service agents on sprinklerwarehouse.com. They really do know their stuff, and they'll get you squared away. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for helpful tips, tutorials, and general sprinkler instruction. Sprinkler Warehouse, America's most shop sprinkler store.